There is so much happening in Afghanistan. I want to share with you what I see uh, spiritually what is happening in Afghanistan and what's happening to Christians in Afghanistan. Uh, Christians in Afghanistan are in panic. They are in trouble. Many of them are trying to leave the country. As you may know, uh, the footprint of our satellite covers Afghanistan, covers Tajikistan, and we have many people, in, Afghan people, who have come to Christ through our uh, satellite broadcast, and they're in touch with us. So we, are, we have been helping them. We have been uh, writing them letters so they can take to U.S. Embassy to get help. We are trying to help them even financially to uh, go from city to city and, if possible, leave the country. Uh, spiritually, what is happening, of course, Taliban, they are taking over. And Taliban are saying, oh, don't be afraid of us. We, we are very kind and we will bring democracy. And they may do that, very unlikely. That reminds me of what happened at Iranian Revolution 79, because when Khomeini came to power, he said the same thing. Oh, I'm, I'm not going to, I'm going to give everybody rights, um, uh, even the, those who are against God, communists, they have a part in my uh, government. I'm not going to kill. I'm going to bring freedom. I'm going to bring heaven on earth. So he was very open the first year or two of, of uh, giving people chance, but once he had the power and he followed the Islam and the commandment of Quran, then the true face of Islam was revealed. And over all these years, Iranians have experienced firsthand what Islam is, what Afghanistan under Taliban are experiencing and will experience, Iranians have experienced for 40 years. So what's the end of it? Taliban will bring much suffering to Afghanistan. But the other, other side, when you look at what happened in Iran, a government led by Taliban and a government led by Iranian Islamic regime will result in the same thing. You know what that is? A revival, an awakening, because people of Afghanistan, just like people of Iran, they will wake up, oh, is this the true Islam? Oh, yes, and we don't want it. So... Even if bad things happen in Afghanistan, we know our Lord is in control. We know our Lord wants to save Iran, wants to save Afghanistan. He used Iranian Islamic government to bring millions of Iranians to Christ. And I believe and I expect the same will happen in Afghanistan under Taliban. So let's help the Christians today. But also, let's pray for Afghanistan that many, many greater harvests of souls will happen in Afghanistan under Taliban, just as it happened in Iran. I am very positive. I hurting because of the suffering of the people of Afghanistan. We at Iran Alive are doing whatever we can. But long term, I know God is going to do a great thing. Be blessed. <music>